Hey guys, today I have more Fenty. So this is the Resting Peach Face Duo. It's 33 Canadian or 25 US dollars. And you get one mini gloss balm cream and one mini cream blush. The blush is in the shade Cheeks Out and the gloss is in the shade Peach Pout. These are both brand new shades for Fenty. Honestly, I just got this for the gloss. I'm really not a blush gal. I don't know how to put it on in a very flattering way. I don't know, my cheeks are just always red enough. I usually just go for bronzer and highlighter, so I'll still talk about it, but just keep in mind, like, I don't know what I'm talking about. The blush shade itself is pretty shimmery. No glitter chunks, but definitely shimmer. It is a really pretty shade and it blends out nicely. Definitely an easy product to work with overall. I think it actually looks okay on me for someone who doesn't really do blush that often. So you know it's easy to use if I can do it. It's not super pigmented, which could be good for some people and not good for other people. So I get, it just depends what you like. It depends on your skin tone. For me, it's not too bad. The gloss the gloss. This is the star of the show for me. This is the whole reason why I bought it. So it's a $33 mini gloss, but overall, I really like the cream formula that Fenty has. However, with this shade, I don't know. I'm wearing it right now and it's pretty sheer. It's a pretty shade. It's just not as opaque as I thought it'd be. It's more of a pink shade with a pop of peach once I have it on my lips. It's still very nice though. At least with the color of my lips, it just kind of blends in too much. So if I want to see the peach really come through, I got to build it up, but then it starts looking a bit too goopy. So I keep it a bit sheer. I just reapplied the gloss to try and get some more peach to show through. I'll show you what I mean by it just builds up really fast. It just starts to look. See, that's like what I thought it would be more so. But then once you get that, ew, you can already see it's like bubbling up. Once you get that thick of an application, it's just uncomfortable. Unless I don't talk or move at all. See, now that's like super peach, but Blech. just builds up inside your mouth and not super flattering. Flattering if you don't move. The only other shade from Fenty that I thought it might compare to is Taffy Tees. That was in the 2020 Glossy Posse. So when you're looking at them just outside in the packaging, they look really similar, but once they're swatched, they are super different. Um, this peach one is, well, it's got the cream formula, so it's more opaque than all the other glosses. And Taffy Tees is, well, it's got the glitter and it's definitely more sheer and it's more bright pink once they are swatched. Anyway, that's all I have for today. Thanks so much for watching and I'll see you later. Bye.